Oh, I really should stop launching that before I start talking. Anyways, hello and welcome. Let's, uh, stop that for a second. Uh, it's Sunday and it's Christmas Eve for everyone who celebrates it. So I, you know, wish you Merry Christmas or almost Christmas at this point. And if you celebrate another holiday, I also wish you were enjoying that or just New Year's. Maybe you just enjoy New Year's. Anyways. Although I have plans, they're not until later, so I'm able to stream like normal. Today we're going to be jumping into some more Monster Rancher. Will we be beating this game today? No. I don't even know how close we'll be getting to the finale. I'm still a ways off on that. Yeah, for being welcome to the stream. I do kind of want to move on to playing its sequel, but I will finish this game first. And it's still enjoyable. The sequel is just a little bit more fleshed out, I guess, but it is notably more difficult from what I hear. I don't recall that I haven't played that in years. But the, um, what was I going to say? Oh, right. Uh, I have mentioned before, my stream schedule is going to be changing starting either this week or by next weekend because it's the week after that I actually have to change it. Sunday will be at the same time. But, um, Wednesday is probably going to have to be moved. That'll either be moved to Thursday night, like after nine, because that, my schedule, I don't have anything in the way on Fridays, or it might become a Friday afternoon thing. I might become, for the most part, the only planned streams being in the weekend stuff and having shorter streams randomized throughout the week. We'll see. I'm trying... I mean, I'm going to increase the time of Sunday streams, which will probably just be streaming the same game for like three hours instead of two hours, or splitting the, the stream in half, one game for half of it, break, and then other half. I'll get through a game faster if I stick to it at that time. Who knows? There's a lot to consider. I've been locked into my ske weird schedule change, but there's still some details I don't know about the schedule. It might make it so I don't have to change as much. We'll see. I don't find out some of those details in another week or two. Anyways, I'm going to stop rambling on about future and stuff, and let's just focus on the enjoyable things. It's the holiday, and we're out to play some Monster Rancher. I'm going to do that every time I launch this game. I'm going to push the wrong button first. Wait, I got a reply on a YouTube comment telling me how to read this. I already closed that tab after we open it. Hold on a second. Oh no, it's still open. That's a good thing. I forgot to close it. Hold on a second. It's Pena. That's how it's pronounced. Because that, the name of this monster I did uh, based on a YouTube commenter of the game. And that'd be why I, that I had to get confirmation of the name. Did I close that tab? Oh, I was like, yes, I, I did. Sorry. Let me check one last thing. All right, it's good. Now we go back to the game. The, the month of stats, been a week. And I'm quite a busy week. Got a lot of skill, got a lot of power. That's about it. Two weeks till battle, so. What are you doing, Pixel? Rob! 
new soundproofing thing on the door and the other cat doesn't like it. Set that I've been kicked out of the room. I take care of multiple cats, but only one cat is mine, and that's the one I let into the room last stream. Yeah, the ones I kick out, because, well, they're annoying. And they just like to prove my point by trying to tear at the carpet. But eh, it's everything here. Anyways, that's uh. We need the item, no one wait till next week. Get a bit more power before you go to the tournament. Let's use the taffy. Oh, we should get some of the... Yeah, um... Uh, yes, w we will, after I go buy it. Oh, new item. You have to actually check that, otherwise they will not start the countdown for the next new item. So let's see what we... Although... What we need, typically... Is this... Oh, we're not going to buy anything else, but I want to see what the new item is. Uh, reduces... Uh, Hardened seam reduces defense by 10, but reducing speed. So, we had the same monsters we had last time with the high defense. That would have been a good one. I do believe using any of those items does lower your li monster's lifespan. I don't think you liked it. Too bad, you're gonna have one more. Forget how strong he is in comparison to Sea Rank. Let's him do what he wants this time around. Apparently the gas tag is very, very effective in, in status effects. Pretty long in monsters, uh, opponent monsters will, so we actually wanted to use it. Well, those intense intelligence is pretty low board intelligence post attack. Anyways, go get him, Pena. Still win. Oh wow, the theory crit. Yeah, that did. That definitely got us the win there.
By the way, that is like a um, signature technique of the hair monster, including in the anime. You can tell a lot of the design was for humor for kids, but especially back then. See how well he does in this one. We lost. Well. Oh, well, they're monsters with equal records, and you can unfight them one more. Now you won the earlier fight, you can win this one. Surprisingly, it's not Entau who made it to the end. I didn't explain before, which I should have talked about when we come as we're approaching probably nearish to the end of this monster's lifespan. Freezing it because it was so much power. Stats are transferred in combination, but you want to get a good combination of two kinds of monsters. And then it'll take the com combined stats of both that monster's stat, like say, Kenya's almost 500 power, and combine it with whatever else we combine it with, and then divide that by 16, and that'll be the stat inherited by the fusion. But that's only if it's a good combination where we'll keep those stats. Determine the effect. Maybe that's the description. Ah, oh, we lost. We were so close to more power. We need more speed, so quickly. So like the more powerful monsters when you fuse within the powerful monster, the more powerful the result can be. But only if you get a good combo. And we're gonna be working towards that. And that's really how you're going to win at the end game. Using a good monster. We're gonna use a herb and actually let him rest. You'd hope it'd be. See, we can keep going with power and try to get it up to level five. That'll be good for when we see a fusion. Or save it to combine for, I mean, increase its speed. It doesn't really get any good stat boost other than power. At this point, I think capping out those power stats would be the best choice.
And I believe it still has um, one more training in power. We'll see. If we get a discount, we'll go and get one no matter what, and we'll see what we can what we can benefit from. A few mint leaves, make sure we stock up on everything. Yeah, Penny is not going to make it to the end of the stream. Obviously, Penny is not ready to move on to B rank. Good job, Penny. You've now got level nine power. No, you can... We are not letting you lose our monster again, especially at its age. No, we can go with a younger monster, or one that doesn't have such high stats. Is there a battle soon? Not for a few weeks. I you rest, you just got to the next level of power. There's a big boost to power. There is! Costs a little bit of speed, which we'd have to make back. But it'll get us to the end faster and get us some life, which we definitely need to increase on him. Then we'll focus on speed after that. limited time, so we're gonna rely on Taffy a bit longer. We'll do this once, maybe twice more at most. Because we don't want to lose too much speed to have to make back up. There we go, level 10. You can keep raising it, but the important part there is we have level 10. I believe level 10 is the max level. I could look that up. 
Next, we gotta get the speed back, because that's the most important part. When's the next? That's a turn official tournament. I don't know if we want to do that. Probably not. Nah, we're gonna leave you at C rank. If you're living for another year, then we'll go up and rank for you. We haven't gotten the warning that you're old yet. few more weeks until there's another turnover we can send him to. We should get plenty of speed. That was definitely the biggest problem for winning last time. Getting hit with too many attacks. Jeffy again. Combining monsters, as I did mention, or loosely mentioned, it's the different kinds of monsters fuse best. Uh, the best would be the same kind of monster, so combining Penny with another hair. Pena. I don't know if you're saying pen. Also, it would inherit its moves at that point. I missed the battle. There's one next week, though. Which we will do unless there's a discount for the training. He's skilled.
that was some good hits. Definitely raising his stats paid off. Oh, we definitely go into the tournament uh, at the end of the month. Um, ah, he knows what he's doing. You should stop looking at the fusion detail or notes on fusions. And actually pay attention to the fights. I think a thousand might be the max of a stat, maybe. Let's actually look at the max of a stat. I mean, good luck getting a stat to max. Like, even with proper fusion methods. You did it! Good job! Uh, he didn't just beat him. He knocked him out, and that's difficult with that monster. His stat, their fame went back up to max. Good for them. speed, so we're not going to use that on him. Yeah, it's next week, so... One more and we get up speed level up. Let's rely on the taffy to go to the tournament. Yay! More speed. Is the item shop? Yep. We need more taffy. Probably some herbs too. Two of them. Now we're good, I guess. You, Pena. You didn't have to even fight in the first one. Yeah, that's um I think we went in stats. Oh, you missed. But well, then you did 50 damage. And reminder, Pain is not a heavy hitter.
Understandable. Have a nice day. Golems are definitely the worst matchup because they are the counter for our build type of being fast hitter that just does a ton of damage but cannot take hits. Understandable, have a nice day. All that's left are Cordy and Entau. Cordy is not a threat. I mean, their speed's annoying. But uh, we still have like a matching amount of skill. Ooh, they might be proving me wrong. Come on, Pena, you can do it. Get a hit in. That's more like it. Ooh. Oh. That sucks. Recordy's already lost two fights. Oh, we've only lost one. Let's see, Entau has lost one as well already, so as long as we win this fight, we win the tournament. And Entau doesn't have the speed advantage that Cordy did. That is indeed how you do it, Pena. That is indeed how you do it. That is how you win. Just wail on your enemy till they're down. So we have a tie with uh, Oregon. We know how this works. Don't get hit and just do a bunch of hits. So no matter how much speed or skill we build up, speed types are always annoying. Calculations got to be different from what it looks like. And we don't have much defense, but still we have like. So much more power. I want a tiny rabbit made of gel. Yeah, that was uh, almost mean. Hey, no wins. Uh, the fame size isn't going to change. Is already at max.
Uh, understandable. Oh no, you can piss off. Pain is old, and also so much stats to potentially lose. I'll send him on a training. Not that, though. But why not? We have the money. Do you have this, like... No, I wanted to see if he had anything to learn from here. The next thing would be speed or skill. So it, it can go get both of those stats. Ah, we have more skills. We'd be more likely to learn a skill-based technique. Since I plan to raise another hair monster to fuse him into in the future, we will get to keep skills or transfer them over. Understandable. So let's use a mint leap to lower your stress. Since came back from training, we'll be nice and let you rest. First, let's see what you learned. Um, it's a big head jab. Just head jab. Well, I don't actually remember what he learned. Skill is so close to a rank up, we'll go for that. Then we'll get back to speed. I would just end up raising stats to make it totally too old now. It's definitely at that point. He's getting tired faster from the looks of it. Skill, then we go back to speed. Good job. He's living a lot longer than I expect him to. The hair is like a three year monster, but they're affected by some food and stuff, the way you treat them. The individual monster itself. And then also the sub monster, which in this case is a slime. Which I don't know how long that monster lives. is not ready. I'm 
rest this time. No, you can go away, Karn. Definitely not this age, the monster. We spent too much time raising it. We focus on intelligence monster, we'll send it though, because it's less likely to get lost. I want to get the training discount because I don't want to spend the full thing on sending him on another one. You're four now. Congratulations. You're a senior citizen. Monster ears are even faster than dog ears. Let's do a regular rest, a speed training, then we'll go on to that battle and see how its stats do in comparison to B-Rake monsters. severely injured, it could end badly, so, you know, save. Nope, he tells what he's doing. A lot of the strategies you want to use with, like, save up will and stuff, uh, works for where we... Which is why you want to take command. Works for other monsters. Not so much for a uh, speedy uh, in fighter like Pena, who, uh, yeah, loses a number of stats, but uh, definitely wins in his specialties. First magic eagle on we've seen. Yeah, no. That is straight to the hospital. Um, what? That's death. No, we're not keeping that. I'll show what the funeral looks like, but um, we are we're not. You know, we're we're loading the save file. There's reasons you want to let a monster die, because, um, unlock stuff. Uh, but we want to deal with one which, which doesn't have so many good stats to fuse. We're not going to that tournament. That is not happening. Nope. 
We're training you and <laughs> turning you into fusion material, buddy. Uh, we'll get speed up to the next level, then you're going for, you're going to become an icicle. You do need a monster to die in order to be able to have a different kind of special monster created called the ghost. But it can be any monster, you don't need to have raised them well, so you can intentionally go out of your way to make one die. Messed up, I know, but that is the me a method. speed we need. We have there. If Lilith and Flareon, both of them are you know. We see their. No, no, I just want to see their stats. There we go, we can check that. No. Uh, how you do it? You're a young one, right? I end up switching monsters with you real quick. I'll wake you later. Nagatsune is kind of weak, it's kind of refused to ever listen. A good fusion fodder for a different monster. Because Woody was kind of... stats were too low. And there's a special monster you can unlock from uh, working with the worm is what I heard about. You look into it, that's the sequel game. This one, uh, once they get to a certain amount of age, they will just develop a secondary type, the regular worm. Like going in a cocoon, but that's... doesn't guarantee it'll be good. I wonder if this will be a good combo. I like using the CD fragments. A so so combination, which means it'll get a uh, decent amount of stats by combining the two. Let's see what we get. Unsurprisingly, we get another doodle. So rude. Nagatune. Nagatwone. What are your stats? Are you good or terrible? Decent. And you didn't keep the skill, but, you know, I didn't expect you to. This is not the monster we're taking, I just wanted to clear up the space. Maybe we'll work with it later, who knows? I want to go have some fun by having the... Yes, I would. We're gonna go with random, and I, I either want another hair type, or something entirely new that we haven't had before. Fitting!
Well, that definitely fits the request I said. We got a plant. And it's just, uh, I was like, what's the secondary type? Swayzo. Uh, wow, what a monster, which means it's probably... Probably got some decent stats. Hmm. I don't even think I spelled that right. Well, welcome to the team, Rutabaga. You got some good skill. Got uh, a mixture of life and attack. I don't know if it's... So... I have not actually... Uh, I don't ever remember using a plant, like, as my... One of my main monsters. So I do not remember how these raise. You going to be intelligent or physical calorie focus? Let's find your stat. You get one pass. Not sending it to the official tournament when it literally been born. Ah, uh, power is not at stat. I know it's got a lot of skill, maybe that'll be its focused one, but let's check intelligent. It said it seemed well, so no. This does not bode well. I don't think it did a job. You destroyed those carrots. One second. Try this again. <laughs> Fine, this time. But better listen next time. Finally. Looks like intelligence is a good stat for it. Fish. It did not behave well enough to get meat. After that, how is its defense raising? I'm gonna assume not very potent. Yeah, it doesn't get much than that. I'm gonna assume it does well in raising skill, and it's misbehaved. Again.
Finally feel sorry. You get one more try, Rutabaga. Because it feel you know that was his last chance. I get angry at it. Bye. Same rule as last time: a hair type or a full random, like something entirely new. Oh, there's a rare monster type that we can't do. It basically means it was one of the special types we haven't unlocked yet. Which one? Don't know. Oh, a dino! And... This looks like a special one. Like the ones where the secondary type is going to be question mark, question mark, question mark. Yep. This is Gallop. Hmm. Trying to think of a good, like, racing horse name, because they always name the dumbest things. Magic Toes. Why not? What are your stats, Magic Toes? Ooh, that was some good basic stats. Look like to be more physical. What is your highest? Like, you got a good deal of power and defense. Everything. Roughly the same, so let's see what your best stat to raise is. I'm gonna assume power, because it's probably good at that. Oh, drop something. Nope, first try is a pass. Do it again? Second try, you don't get a pass. Okay, if it asks nicely, and if it's young.
Apparently you don't want to combine a hair with a hair. You want to combine with other monsters. Like a gel, or... Monol, or... A something. Combines well with a pixie, apparently. If this one continues to be annoying, we'll go try combining our hair with a pixie. And we've got a good combo of uh, monsters. This thing called the uh, power or fusion calculator for Monster Rancher. Well, I'm not getting some good luck with these monsters, am I? Do one job. No. Seriously. The magic toad decided to be annoying. I have not had a good luck with monsters today. <laughs> hmm. I'm gonna think about this one a bit, but. Seems like it's a good combo, honestly. I have this kind of boost things. The CD Fragment boosts the stat. I don't even know what Pink Jam is, but... Seen it, several of them seem weird. Hold on.
Mm, I think I'll go with the hair one, so... Question is, do we want to go for Buster or that? No, wait, it's good randomized, so I can't even choose. We got lucky, we got the hair one. Like, which one do I was hoping for the most? We got, we got Buster, the hair pixie. Combine the two monsters' names. This is two good monsters. Well, let's check your stats. Got a good duo boost of stats. And skills. Didn't keep all of them, but I got a new one. Let's check our monsters in the book before we go back to the ranch. All right. Gallop, a regular thoroughbred with a lot of potential. Buster, he has a weak, out of shape, and flabby stomach. Hints. If you don't discipline this monster, he'll become a brat. Oh, he started out as one. Wait. Do we have a different one? No, that was the same one. Never mind. Let's hope this one's a good one. I'm gonna go with they're probably good at raising power. They have no life stats. Let's check what they're good at raising, then we'll go with raising their life to 100 as well. He's there, not surviving any. You get a pass in the first one. That's more like it. Only three power, so power is not their stats? How about intelligence? Oh. You get a pass in the first one still. You've only been alive for a month. And you were two good monsters, so... Okay, and this time you do not get a pass. I have not been getting lucky with my monster starts this time around. This one's better. Intelligence is their clear stat.
That's how they do on the other ones. They do not raise defense. They do raise skill well. They got intelligence and skill. Hey, what about speed and life? No, you get on the first attempt at any job, you get a pass. I don't want to give you this month. Eat, of course. Reduce training fees. Chris saying about training. First, since we have the whole month, we're going to again test out how they do on speed, and then we'll let them rest. you're going on an intelligence training. to waste. Seriously? Three fails? Okay, oh. this time, yes, you failed three times and didn't bring back a skill. You at least get stat boost to let it pass. My luck with monsters has just been terrible today. Anyways, See how your speed boosts go. Succeed this time. Thank you. Oh, you do well for boosting speed. And then how do you do for raising life, which you need to raise a lot of? Yes, you need to start behaving. How are your stats? Like, life is atrocious. Speed's almost the next level, we know it can raise it. And let's see how you raise it. Please raise it well, because I want to be able to get you up to 100 without too much of a problem. Oh, that's gonna be fun. Down in skill. How much do you have in skill again? I believe you do well in raising it. So, that's what we're gonna have to do. It's the only way to reasonably get them a life stat. 
there's like... There we go. This will be the one little bit of the stats we need. We'll be able to easily get the skill back. We'll be able to get both life and defense up to usable amounts. As you learn with the predecessor, you don't need a lot, but you need a life set to be at least a hundred. Buy more. Is there an item that just raises to life? No, it was the opposite other way around, so you know. To 100, we can't reasonably send them at any tournaments, even if they max out their loyalty. All their other stats are really good, just the life stat is atrocious. That'll result. We can send him out on life training this time. No, wait, intelligence. It's still a good idea. We can get a skill from that. That's their focus stat after we get the other ones boosted. Now let's let them rest so they don't start getting weight. As much as I want to get them the life boost, because intelligence also can be related to the skills we want to go for. We want to send them off on that. Success! Keep up the success. Absolutely! Good job! We're already stocked up on items. You can rest in a second, let me just check what your new ability is. A physical attack. Why do you only learn physical attacks? We know it learns a, um, is it the, the skill one that learned the, or might have been the power one that learned that, uh, 
Poison attack. Mm. We're almost there for health, so it, even though it means we'll have to get skilled back up another level, it'll be easy in comparison. Just twice more, and we'll also be able to get the fence up to it at level 2 as well. We've gotten its two terrible stats into a usable range. Once more, and then we'll raise his skill back up. Oh, fail. It's the last time you go into the mines. Pull it off. Thank you. Skill back up and its speed is almost the next level. I'll get skill back up and then we'll get speed above another level. Oh, and intelligence, then we'll go into a tournament. Here's power life. Intelligence is skill. Ah, no. We just got defense up to that level. the next tournament. Not back to their starting point for skill. Only about, but only about like 10 or so lower and it's at the right level. Uh, let's see. Intelligence is just under power. It's a bit more difficult to raise. The speed is just a bit under, so intelligence first, then we'll go for speed. You can rest like normal. I'll do a turn today. Whoops. Good job, little pen. I guess we'll get the speed up to the next level before we go to a tournament. We'll go to that tournament next month. We want to see how they do in an E rank tournament before we go picking fights. Understandable, you don't like it. But we need to prevent you from becoming too chubby. It's bad for your health and bad for your stats in battle.
And we're not going to an official tournament. We haven't gone to a regular tournament yet. stats like we're not gonna focus on strength but it's just under a level up so might as well get it oh their ability to raise strength has drastically increased Is three in this story, but now it's five. So it's like the same as intelligence. Oh, they failed. I won't punish you this time, but only because you're going to a tournament. And they're year old. I think we'll want to focus heavily on getting its stats up. More so treating this one as a monster raising, I mean, as a stat boosting one for future fusion. It's not going to be the one that takes us to the end. We need to get two really good ones. To do that, it might be easier to just keep it at a low rank of tournaments and rig, send it, have it raise money and send on a bunch of trainings if the goal is just stat boosts. At least still master the techniques. I'll probably do that. And once it runs out of the techniques for the three, then I'll raise up to see right. I don't really have that many stats over it. It's not OP in any way. That's what I'm doing. Screamed the monster away. I don't like dinosaurs. Makes dinosaur feel bad. going as well. I don't even remember you can dodge. Yeah, it doesn't have the physical stats that its predecessor did. 
First tournament, I suppose, gets a pass on that. We are out of those. There we go, power up the next level. Hmm. Now we're just gonna focus on raising an absolute ton of stats as quick as we can. Waiting on moments up for discounts for the training. Not the discount I wanted, but whatever. Here's open there's a skill or not a training discount. There is not one. This is not going to be one of the tournament monsters. I'm more just going to raise its stats and unlock skills for fusion in the future. Good job for you. We'll get to intelligence to 300, we work on speed and skill. 
We could get power to 200. Probably do that if we get the other ones to 300. but you need it. Even too many taffies, you know, chubby. Now nah, we're not going to go moving on until absolutely whale in the tournament. That is the answer. Grand Intelligence, and we'll go speed next. Train discounts are more often like after your monster gets a good deal of um, uh, fame. I don't remember the word. I was, my brain kept saying resume, but that's not technically not fame. The other one forfeited before. Ah! Ah! Yeah, that'll be good reasons.
I'm probably gonna lose this fight. How is this golem so good at dodging? Oh, that was close. Literally 1% difference there. Congratulations! After we save, we're setting them up on training. Is there a discount? No. But that's kind of the reason why we're doing the battles. I'm not advancing. Money. I, I must... Have they learned the max? They have not. I mean, they might have... They should have enough stats to learn it now. And they should be done at intelligence. And it's gonna get them a lot more intelligence stat, so, you know, double the benefit. Good job, little man. <laughs> Absolutely! Should have given it a tap before it went out to get rid of any fatigue it had. you learn? And besides, how to be much smarter. Eh. Another physical attack, close range. When's the next battle we be- well, today. Ooh, fitting! Absolutely! We gotta go to the Christmas tournament on Christmas Eve! The Christmas Cup, we have to absolutely win. Ladies and gentlemen, we will now begin the battle. First up is Lily Pen versus Glumbar. I don't want to let Lily Pen do what they want. Hmm. I don't know what the stats difference mean. They clearly don't mean anything. <laughs> and Lily Pen knocks Slamber out with one good shriek. Clearly, this Karen is too much. The, the humble manager loses immediately. Lily Pen versus Bune next. Now he knows how to scream people into submission. Begin the battle! 
And yet again, the Leaf Hen wins by shrieking their opponent into sheer submission. The grating voice knocks everyone out. It's a little painful for the audience. And now, Lily Pen versus Jet. Ready? Fight! Ah! Lily Pen uses their signature move, ah! the scream. And they do get good in two good shouts, knocking Jet out. Okay, might be time to rank up to the next rank. Shop discount. Oh, it's at its prime, its life. When you're, hmm, well, we're gonna get intelligence up to 400, and then we'll work folks on speed and skill. When is the next? It's next week. Clearly, we need to go to that tournament. Oh, I thought it was more stocked up than this. I'm sorry, but can you, when you can one-shot the entire tournament, might be time to rank up. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we will now begin the battle. Lipen versus Barura. No, Lily Pen knows how to scream. But Barura doesn't have ears. How will that work? Probably still well when you look at those stats. <laughs> really well. Lily Pen uses their signature move. Knock! their opponent out with one screech. You and this side withdraw, so Lily Pen wins. The next opponent gave up and got scared. I mean, wouldn't you? You've been knocked out by the opponent's scream before and you see it do it again? We have not knocked Regar out with one scream before. Now it's time for Lily Pen versus Regar. How many screams will this fight take? Ah! The answer is one. Ah, ah, ah. One scream. Ah, ah, ah. Lily Pen wins, much to no one's surprise. Why are you punching the air? You. You didn't win with any physical effort. It was entirely screaming. Absolutely. Hold on, it's real. I had left something charging behind me and um, definitely charged. Didn't want to overcharge too much. Let's 
stock up later. For now, let's give you a taffy. Get your max energy and send you off on another training. We have the money. Probably not an intelligence one. I think you've got all the skills you can get out of that. Let's check. Nope. As much as the stats are good, we also benefit from stats from this and new skills. So, you know. Might as well do that one. Because they're also good at raising skill. And speed, but we don't have speed unlocked yet. Good job, Lieutenant. How did you do on skill? No. Probably didn't have the stat requirement. Next work is uh, next week is a tournament. What is your stats right now? Yeah, we want to raise intelligence, get that up to 400, because we can. You know, more fuel for the screams. See how they do in this tournament, and if they do as well as they did in the last tournament, uh, we'll go to C rank, and we can also unlock the others trainings. We won't have as big of a stat gap, but you know. Still have a stat gap. <laughs> It's been sitting there for the entire hour and a half, like, well, almost two hours, yeah. Like, I've been, why did that just suddenly fall? There we go. Not a one-shot, but still, so close. Ooh, painful. You know, but not as painful as getting knocked out. Pen knows what they're doing. Ah, ah that's how we do things, Lily Pen. Quite as powerful, but you know, it only took two screams. Yeah, um, we're going to the, the main tournament, getting up to C rank, so we can, you know, access better trainings. So let's give you a taffy just because um we're very tired rather than just tired.
I hit the wrong button. Remember, it's the end of this month, so of course we're going for that. So we're getting intelligence up to max, then we'll put some skill. Not max, it's up to 400. to rest. We're just regular tired. We can fix that easily. All right, we'll give you a tapping. I mean, I'm just gonna have to give you all the snacks. But yeah, because you need to burn some weights. stream in a few minutes, but we can go just a little longer. Yep, Nelly Pin knows what they're doing. Go and scream Igunisu into Igunisu into submission. Scream, so almost took this one. They really should be forfeiting. My screams are gonna take them out. I mean, I get that this one's tankier, but still, it's not gonna help them much against the screeches of victory. And that almost one shot it. These are definitely getting sent to the hospital. <laughs> Mikhail was smart. Feels so nice you're going into a battle against Guron and have no worries. <laughs> Never mind, some worries. Shriek, it's your winning move! Ah! And of course it missed. 
Why is Goron so good at dodging? Its speed isn't that high. Well, not as much of an overwhelming victory as all the other fights, but still. Still an overwhelming victory in a way. Only Pen knows what to do. Scream that whirl out of the Madrina. Me? Bites! <laughs> Bites over. Them rest first. I'm gonna send them on this training that I'm gonna wrap up the stream after that. You send them on speed or skill is the question. I'll probably learn a new move and skill. And then we can just focus on speed for ne next time. Get a bunch of stats and also learn the other skill from skill. Wait, they're called techniques. There's no this week's training. What are they even doing? Get short of ranking up skill. We're not gonna punish you. Failed, but you succeed next time. Press them and wrap up the stream there. May have failed to get a new skill, but um, who are using this stats? Yes. This is where I'm going to be wrapping up the stream. Closing the game down right now. There we go. Anyways, I've been Lord Jabu. I've had a good time and you have... Uh, having a Merry Christmas tomorrow or Happy New Year's. If, or whatever holiday you celebrate that occurs this week. I believe there's a few others. Or were a few others. I forgot what my calendar said. Um, this has been Monster Ranch for today. This week will be the, and it'll look like normal for stream time. I'll still have a Tuesday and a Wednesday stream, probably. Sorry about the Wednesday. I, like I said, tweeted out I was sick, so I had to cancel that stream. It's after this week that my schedule is changing, like next weekend. Speaking of, I should check what day New Year's is on, because I do not believe I'll be streaming New Year's evening. Next Sunday, I might stream, I might not. We'll see as we get closer to it. Wednesday, uh, Tuesday and Wednesday will have normal streams, though. 
Right, Tuesday's Kwanzaa. That's what was on, uh, is on the calendar. So again, that was in coincided stuff. So to anyone who celebrates that, um, and have a happy holiday. Anyways, said so, uh, tune in Tuesday night at nine thirty. Might, might might be earlier. Who knows? Pacific Standard Time for the continuation of Indivisible. Which will be moving to a different night after this week. I will decide by then, by by next weekend. So it'll be information then. It it either be on Thursday evening or I might keep it on Wednesdays, but probably not because I have to. I'll have to get up really early and leave. Start on Thursdays probably, unless they tell me I could don't have to come in later than I think I do. Then that won't be an issue. On Wednesday it stays the same. We'll see. Wednesdays are gonna become really busy for me. Tuesdays through Thursdays, I'll be stupid busy, starting on the 7th, 8th, like the second week of January. So yay for that. And tune in Wednesday night at 8 p.m. Six Standard Time for what should hopefully be the finale of Graveyard Keeper? I'm at, I'm at the end of it, and I just want to move on to a new game. I'll wrap that up. I'll have to do a bonus stream or something while I'm still in my schedule thing to wrap that up. We'll see. It'll be easier because I'm not to probably shift only two stream nights a week. So uh, wrapping up one game will be good. Anyways, enough rambling about that. I've been Lord Jabu. I hope you had a good time and you have a happy holidays. And I hope to see you all again later. With that, have a good morning, evening, or night. And I will see you all next time. Goodbye. <laughs>